This video demonstrates how to use the communicator application as a gate from OPCDA to OPCUA. Let's create a new project. And configure reading from the OPCDA server as we did in one of the previous video. choose the OPC Classic device type. We don't need to create channels and configure the web interface. Just working with data. Add some elements into the subscription. Upload the project to execution to check if we can successfully read data from the OPC DA server. Check the communication line log and we can see that data are coming correctly. The next step is to open the data sources configuration and activate the OPC UA server data source. Open its properties. We have to tick the checkbox to auto automatically accept certificates from the OPC UA clients is needed in initial stage. Later you can untick this checkbox. It's recommended to create configuration file for Windows or Linux uh, to be able to configure the OPC, so OPC UA server more specifically. Uh, in this example we will use the default configuration and leave this text box blank. Click OK and upload the project again. Open the communicator logs and switch to all files. You can find the log file of the OPC UA server. Select the server address and press Ctrl C to copy the line. After that, open process OPC UA browser. It's a client to access our OPC UA server. Enter the connection address. You can choose encryption if needed. And we have to specify username and password because they are set in the OPC server configuration. Username is OPC, password is SCADA. Accept the certificate of the server. And we can browse the server contents. read data it 
if we switch to the log file, you can see that the client is connected, subscription is created. This information can be useful. It is also possible to write data to the OPC DA server from the OPC DA client. Let's demonstra demonstrate it. The first item can be written. Other items are random. Data was passed from OPC UA to OPC DA and written to the OPC DA server. You can find the right operation in the OPC UA server log and in the OPC DA client log. Thank you for watching. Goodbye.